temperature was uh, still hovering around 36 degrees in high summer, sometimes more. Well, of course, uh, up and down's job uh, was to go out uh, late evening and uh, pick, pick olives, and grapes and oranges in uh, this region of Malta. It was based, uh, I've said it, down in uh, Mostar. Also in Valletta and over at Melilla, but she would come up here sometimes to uh, the silent city to get her thoughts about me. And sometimes she would write a letter to me from here, she told me. I've been here before to see her, but she wasn't uh, around. She had uh, heard I was coming and uh, hid, in, hid in the convent for three weeks. So the uh, mother superior said, Yes, I've been here before, I remember it very well. These are some of the streets that uh, she would walk around in Rabat. It's uh, preaching to all who listen. She's done a great job. This is the, uh, the silent city of Molina, here in Rabat, and uh, this is the, uh, the areas that uh, up and down would um, just frequent. And um, well, she was she was in this part of the world for a very long period, and. Um, 
But she didn't manage to speak any Maltese. She used Italian and some Arabic. As I say, she's fluent in five different languages, including French, German, Italian. She speaks some Bulgarian. And she says, uh, I've got some Austrian. And she, uh, yeah, that's a sort of German dialect, isn't it? Austria. The, so we go through here, we're going to the big tower. This is the first uh, port of call where the bells are. It's not long after 11 o'clock on a beautiful Maltese day. 25th of November, I believe. I'm sure it is. I'm sure you will agree it's very picturesque. Picturesque indeed. There's the exact time. It's, uh, it's so different from Milan, isn't it? Well, what? Malta built with traditional Maltese uh, limestone. And uh, these uh, fantastic houses. Up and down. Up and down, are you there? Boo, wait, hey, boo, up and down. <laughs> there is she. This is what I mentioned about in Nîmes, where you have the narrow streets, and uh, they're much narrower uh, here in Malta, uh, primarily because of the, um, the need for blocking out the intense sunshine in high summer. So you can see how cooling that would be to be wandering around here, even though it's uh, hitting 45 to 50 degrees out, you know, which it does uh, often. Hey, boo-boo. Morning. Sparrows are building a nest. 